Hey, hey, up. welcome everyone to this week's episode of the Amazon Files brought to you by Mommy Income. I am your host, Kristen Ostrander, and I have got something that's going to save you about a week's worth of work. So recently, I have dug into some research. I've been doing a lot of research, and the research is not what you think. The research that I've been doing, well, I don't know what you think. I can't read your mind. <laughs> I wish I could. Um, but honestly, the research results are in. See, I've been conducting, I don't know if a while back you noticed that I asked for some feedback. I asked for people to book some calls on my schedule so that I could ask about feedback, about the course, about wholesale bundles, about their business, about everything, right? You know, just, hey, jump on a call with me. And that we spent many, many weeks doing that and surveying a lot of students that signed up for one of these time slots and asked some questions and got a lot of interesting feedback. And the results are in. The results are in. And I want to share them with you because I've got something that can help. Because chances are, as a seller, you are spending a lot of time doing research. And there are some things that can help you. Specifically, you know, I'm going to talk about wholesale bundles, right? Because honestly, that's those are you guys are my students. You're my students with wholesale bundling. I, I believe 100% that it works. It profits me a lot of money every single year. And I wanted to do the same for you. So in my research, I've been doing it um, for many months now and asking students about their successes and their struggles when it comes to bundling. And I wanted to share the results with you because they blew me away. They blew me away. 37% of wholesale bundlers have not launched a bundle yet, those who have uh, gotten the course. And there's a few common threads that are coming through with over and over again. You know, I sat with students on Zoom, on the phone, on surveys, through email, through DMs, chatting about all of their struggles and successes when it comes to bundling. 37% of them have not launched a bundle yet. So if that's you, if you have not yet launched a bundle, or maybe you launched a bundle and it did not go very well, or you struggled, or you have one in progress, I wonder if you can relate to any of these. These are like some quotes and some things that, that, that all, we gathered all the research and then we kind of combined everything of what people said and kind of put them into categories. They genuinely believe that bundling works and that it's awesome, but they don't know which vendors that they, they want to start with. They struggle to come up with ideas. They want a place to start so they can gain confidence in the process. This is an overwhelming process. Y'all, just a reminder, the wholesale bundle system is a million dollar strategy. It has earned me and many of my students and a combined $20 million in revenue on Amazon. This is no small thing. So if you're struggling, you're overwhelmed, that's okay, that's normal. It's not every day that you learn a million dollar system that you can repeat over and over and build up your Amazon store and stores outside of Amazon to continue in e-commerce. So do you want a pace to start to gain confidence? That's fine. It's a, it's it's not going to be easy. I never promise easy, right? They also, many of them said they, they lack the creativity. They just can't come up with bundles. They get stuck with like, oh, I have 14 catalogs and I have all these open accounts, but I can't figure out which bundle to start first. And the last one, and I think this is probably the most relatable to most people, is they overanalyze and become paralyzed. Analysis paralysis. We just talked about this a couple of weeks ago on the podcast, the fear of launching. Well, I've done the research, but I just, I'm just not sure. I've lost money before. I don't know how, I just, I'm, I'm scared. Paralyzed with fear that it's not going to go well. Which one of those do you relate to the most? Because honestly, they're all real. It's all a struggle. When we do anything for the first time, we're going to overanalyze and be a little bit nervous. That's normal. That's because you care about what you're doing. You know that, right? It comes from that place of fear. Why? I don't want to screw this up. Why? Because I care about it. So if you're feeling nervous, that's really normal. It's fear. That's fine. It's normal. If you if you're not creative, that's the thing. This is this is these are things that we can problems we can solve, right? These are problems we can solve. So which one of those do you relate to the most? The fear, overanalyzing, struggling to come up with ideas. You have you, you don't know where to find the vendors and get stuck in the weeds of research. Like who among us has twenty tabs open at one different time and you're following all the rabbit holes? Even though the course is following all the steps and following the steps, it's really easy to get lost in research. So now let's talk about the 63% of wholesale bundle students that we surveyed 
who already had at least one bundle launched. Here's what they had to say. It was a rough start, but now I'm selling out. So that's a direct quote. These are direct quotes from students, okay? I've, I'm already on my second, third, and fourth bundle is already on the way. That's another quote. My bundles sell great, but I wish there was more automation in the process. That's one that I really leaned into because honestly, research takes some time, yes. But are there things that we can maybe automate? I mean, in the world of AI and everything else, can we automate? Yeah, there's some things we can for sure automate. As a matter of fact, I'm, I'm going to give you just a little like a teaser. Um, we've got something in the works with Merchant Words that might help some of our automation. So stay tuned for that. Um, but here's the deal. Everyone's art, they're successful bundling already. They're just saying, I wish this was faster. I wish it was just a little bit faster. I could wish I could create bundles faster. The rest of the process, you can use a prep center, you can order um, products remotely, things like that. But the hardest part is really coming up with the ideas, vetting the ideas, making sure that there's not a billion co competitors out there. Okay. With growth and successful bundlers, they have struggles too. So they not they might not be in analysis paralysis, but they have a new set of issues with more products and bundles to manage creates more business for you. That means you need to create more hours in your schedule to handle your inventory, handle uh, is issues with incoming outgoing shipments, ordering products, keep staying on top of, you know, keeping your bundles in stock, right? So with growth, which is what we want, also comes limitations. And while growth is what we're after, it sometimes hinders us from completing the bundle research process. As a matter of fact, we've had bundlers all admit that they've had home runs and duds. We've all had home runs and duds. I love that they, they use that like bundle dud. Like I've never really got oh, it's kind of a dud. After you you troubleshoot it many times, you're like, oh, okay, that's fine. That's why we tell you to start small. We're not spending ten thousand dollars on our first bundle. We're gonna test it. We're gonna send it. We're gonna test it. And you know, this is the thing. That's what's great about wholesale bundles is that they're unlike private label, you're not investing thousands and thousands of dollars into one product. You're vetting an idea. You're looking like it has a pretty good uh, rate of success. You're, you're fully vetting it with all these research and tools and everything else. And you're bringing it to the Amazon marketplace. So if you spend two, three hundred dollars, maybe five hundred dollars on a bundle and you realize after three, four months that it's really just just wasn't what you thought it was. You can individually sell those items, you can liquidate them, you can sell them, but you, you're not out thousands of dollars. You can have another bundle. And then this is the most recent thing. After our recent workshop in Dallas, um, we had, everyone was saying after we did our trade show walkthroughs, and I love walkthroughs because we can just look at everything that's in front of us. It's like the shopping mall of bundles. And I can point out in every booth here, what about this idea? What about this idea? What about this? Yeah, like I see four, five, six, seven bundles and everyone's eyes kind of glaze over and they're like, what? I don't see what you see. They see it after I point it out, right? So the general consensus in Dallas this year was, Kristen, can you create a bundle for us? Can you just create us a bundle? Like we, we just buy your bundle ideas. And you know, I've been hinting at this for months now, but now it's finally ready. So I'm gonna tell you about it. Yes, I've decided, sure you can buy my bundles. Why y'all, I have a notebook. Yes, I still use pen and paper here. I have a notebook of bundle ideas. I get catalogs and I sit down and I write with them and I have catalogs that have sticky notes all over them and I have not yet used one of those bundle ideas. Why? I'll be honest, because my store is plentiful already. We are managing as much as we want to manage right now. And yes, we have bundle turnover. So I have a notebook and things like that. We have bundle turnover. And so we pick one from the queue when we know one is starting to fizzle out. So bundles do fizzle out. Nothing lasts forever. You're not an iPhone, right? So, I mean, even iPhones every year, they, they bring you a new one, right? Bundles we're creating, everything has a shelf life. Everything has a, a timeline, a shelf life, whatever you want to call it. And so you always have to have bundles in the queue that you're bringing to the table and maybe some seasonal ones because that's how you keep your business well-rounded. But as far as like creating constant new and growing to a bigger level, no, we've actually reached a level where we're comfortable with our staff or comfortable with our team. And we have a lot of successful bundles already. So we have, we're at max capacity. 
and we're good with that. So what am I going to do with all these amazing bundle ideas? Client after client after client comes to workshops and uh, co coaching calls and in our hub. And they say, they say, why you have all these ideas, like spill the beans. Um, and I am spilling the beans, except for there's even more. There's even more help to provide. So I can give you all the ideas, but that's not what you said your problem was. Some of you have creativity issues, but that's not always your problem. Sometimes you overanalyze even the ideas that you're given. So that's the issue. Some of you are so busy just killing it and making a lot of money and doing the things that you don't have a lot of time for the research process anymore. So I have created some done for you bundles that I'm ready to release. They're complete done for you bundles. So what does that mean? I mean, first of all, uh, let me just clarify. I am not called the bundle queen for no reason. I've been e-commerce for 20 years and I've been doing bundling for eight years now. Like I've been doing bundles before bundles was a word. So I've been known to say I have more ideas than I know what to do with. And after sitting with so many students, I realized that done for you bundles will help so many people who are struggling for one of the reasons we've already mentioned. So what is a done for you bundle? I am personally creating product bundles for you to purchase and list in your store. These bundles are developed and certified using the wholesale bundle framework, and you will receive a fully researched bundle listing ready for you to copy and paste right into Amazon. You simply purchase the done for you bundle package from us, contact the vendors, order the products, order your custom packaging, copy and paste the listing essentials that we've given you and send your products to Amazon. A completely vetted, fully researched bundle. Now here is what we provide with that bundle. A customer avatar. Who, what, when, where, why, and how of a bundle. If you guys have been in my courses, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Title, description, key product features, bullet points, search terms, basic images, basic. You might have to do some work, people. That's okay, right? vendor contact information item numbers for the product purchase cost of goods suggested price suggested order quantity and recommended packaging yes that is all the things we're giving you a bundle from all fully vetted so that is what a done for you bundle is and this is what y'all have been asking for hey can you just create bundles for us sure why not you know why because I'm actually really good at creating bundles. I love bundles. I get excited when catalogs come in. I have ideas coming out of my ears. So why not? Now, someone asked me recently, well, what's your worst selling bundle? And how do you do on that? And I was like, oh, gosh, I had to look at the numbers. And um, we actually almost cut the cord on this bundle because we thought, oh, you know, we, we have a criteria for bundles. If we're not really selling one every day, so think of 30 in a month um, over over a quarter, we cut the cord. We say, you know what, it, it's got to be selling one a day. Otherwise, it's probably dead water. But then we looked at some math and we realized that there was one that was selling 17 to 25 a month, which is below our standard. But then we realized we were making a boatload profit on it. We made $7,000 on our worst bundle last year. So even on our worst bundle, we're making, I, I couldn't cut the cord at 7,000. If you start, can't, totaling up how many units you've sold and how many your average profit for each one. I'm like, no way I'm cutting the cord on that. So that is the potential for bundles. We have uh, one student in our hub who uh, I helped co-create a bundle with her and her first year on that bundle, she made over $21,000 in profit on a bundle we created. This is the power of creating a bundle using a framework that works. And if you don't have the time or the creativity to be able to create a bundle, that's what done for you bundles will do. So are you making at least $7,000 a year on one of your bundles? Now done for you bundles are great. They're great for the beginner. You could experience the process of creating your own bundle without the stress and pressure of the research. The process alone for listing a bundle, creating your custom packaging, sending stuff into Amazon, all of that stuff if you're a beginner is already a weighing heavy on you, creating your business, everything else. So this can take the weight off of your shoulders to be like, okay, I can try this process before I have to really dig into the research. Those who are struggling to come up with ideas on your own. Leave the creativity to me. I've got this. I have so many bundles. Uh, and you know what? They don't have to be sexy. They don't have to be stuff that you are in love with. They just have to be fully researched, knowing that there is supply and demand and there's a gap between them. 
How about successful bundlers? You know it takes a ton of time to research and create product bundles. This will save you a week's worth of work. If it takes you, oh, that was another piece of the research I wanted to share with you. The, the number one answer for the question we asked about how long does it take you to create a bundle, those that are bundlers and have already sent a bundle, they said about a week. Five days was a close second. A week. This will save you a week's worth of work. Sometimes people have more time than they have money and they have more money than they have time. So this is a, an option for those of you who have that. Now, done for you bundles are uh, application only. We have to know that you are qualified to create a listing, that you're qualified with the with all the things that you're going to need to, to do a wholesale bundle. Some of you may, some of you may not. So make sure that you check that out when you uh, Done for you bundles are a application only process. So when you click the link below, you'll see that if you click, if you go to mommyincome.com forward slash done for you bundles, you will see uh, the application there. So make sure that you go and check that out. If this is something that you've been waiting for, I know some of you are on a waiting list already for the done for you bundles. They are here and they are ready for you. But unfortunately, it's not for everyone. It's by application only. So make sure that you also check your inbox. You're not in your inbox. If you're not in, uh, you don't get email emails from us at mommy income go to mommyincome.com forward slash subscribe also done for you bundles aren't for everyone they're for wholesale bundle students and there's a reason wholesale bundle students my students that take my wholesale bundle system they know exactly what i'm talking about when i'm using the language they understand what's required of them by the rules and policies of amazon the best way to put a bundle together so that you don't get in trouble with other brands other companies that you're doing it all above board and legit that scares a lot of people away. That's okay. Um, my students are qualified if they are wholesale bundle students and you must um, apply. So mommyincome.com forward slash bundles, done for you bundles with, uh, and you can apply now for that. I just want you to know that sometimes people beat themselves up and they never try something because they're afraid to fail. They're honestly afraid to fail. This is just me telling you that everyone fails. Everyone makes mistakes and everyone is going to even their first time, especially your first time. You're gonna make mistakes and that's okay. If you've ever had a dud bundle and you're just like, oh, to heck with bundles. I tried that once, it didn't work out. Bundles can work if you know exactly what to do. And the wholesale bundle system teaches you that. And then this is a way to even just sh show you that bundles work. You can purchase a done for you bundle, put it in your store. It's almost, it's, it's almost better than choosing a lead list. Why? Because done for you bundles are also one of a kind. They're one of a kind. I am not giving these bundles to anyone else. Nobody gets the same bundle. No one gets the same bundle. You'll come to the page and if you are qualified to purchase one, you will see the multiple options that you have. They range in cost of goods anywhere from below $10 to up to $25 in cost of goods. We give you a suggested quantity. So whether you buy 24, 36, 60, something about the sales volume that we think you'll have. So we give you even those items, but you have to understand done for you bundles are product development packages that we're creating. We're spending a lot of time and energy and research creating a one of a kind bundle. That means that you and only you will get this bundle. We're not selling the ideas to multiple people. So because they're one of a kind, we have to do application only. So we make sure everyone understands the terms and conditions. This is an elite advanced product development package. So it's not for everyone and that's okay. But if you feel like it is for you, I encourage you to apply for a done for you bundle. I love to create bundles. I can't wait to see the successes of all these bundles out there on Amazon with all of, of you guys' brands and what you have out there. I'm excited for you, especially if you have been on the fence about a bundle for one of these reasons that we've mentioned and you really just struggle to pull the trigger on that first one. This might help you a ton. So mommyincome.com forward slash done for you bundles is how you apply and learn a little bit more about exactly what you get when you purchase one of these. You guys, 
thank you for the opportunity to serve you. I know that you could be doing any other thing at any other point. Now, I don't take that for granted. Thank you so much for listening to the Amazon Files podcast. See you same time, same place next week.